Yes, hi, all. Good evening, all. I think you can all hear my voice clearly now. Yes, ma'am. Okay, fine. Yes, ma so, you have any doubts, all? Last class, whatever we discussed, any doubts in that? No, ma'am. Okay. Okay. So, here you can see I have taken a very small uh, paragraph here. Okay. So, first, let me explain you. Uh, like uh, using this paragraph, what are all the designs you can do? Say in the design tab, mainly in the design tab, you will be focusing with the page color, page border, watermark. So three things are there. Okay, page color, watermark, and um, page border. Okay, so those things you can see here only. Say watermark, page color, and page border. So if I click on a page color, you can select any of the page color you want. Say so any of the page color. See? Any of the page color you want, you can do it from here. Okay, like this. And this is a shading. Okay, so if you want a shading, so just click on page border option. Say shading. If you click on this shading, any of the color that you select okay so that kind of shading will be appeared over there like this okay so this is a very simple only page color page border everything watermark means any of the watermark you can apply that means a name you can apply a name in the back end okay so i'm just clicking on custom watermark Click on text. 
written my name so i'm just changing the color apply click ok you can see the watermark how it is applied this page number page border watermark you know that will come for all all pages if you give for one page that will automatically appear for all the pages understand any of the page color you give or any of the border color you take you give for for one page automatically that will be applied for all the pages so now it is only one page right say i am just going to insert and i am clicking on insert a blank page say if i click on insert blank page number of pages to take for all the pages it will come watermark will come borders will come for all the pages see like this you can see okay clear no this is a very simple thing that comes under the design tab so in the insert tab you also have a flow chart say uh, if you click on a shades you have all the different kind of a shades say you can select any of the shape you want you can put that shape here say all the shapes you can use here any of the shape you want you can use that kind of shape say like this and you can also use this uh, flow chart also say last class also i explained you right so any of the flow chart you want you can apply so for example now i am going to share you some of the flow charts okay in a group i am going to share you some of the flow charts just observe here how that flow charts will come okay flow charts is also more important to do actually just observe how can you do that flow chart okay flow charts paragraph using a shaping how to do everything i have done here okay now say like let me show you one flow chart how to do so here just observe i am going to show you one flow chart okay this is a start i am selecting like this start okay rectangle shape or you can use any of the shape you want ठीक है ये कौन है पैन से भी ठाकुर अंदर से अंदर से जस्ट अस ऑल एरोमार्क आई हैव टेकन हियर ओके आई हैव टेकन स्मॉल एरोमार्क हियर दैट्स ऑल क्या मैं तो मैं सुख कर रही हूं ओके आई हैव टेकन अ वेरी स्मॉल एरोमार्क लेटर यू हैव वन मोर शेप जस्ट ऑब्जर्व दैट पर्टिकुलर शेप आई एम गोइंग टू सेलेक्ट हियर लाइक दिस exactly that shape is available okay see guys if you are interested only be in the class if you are not not interested please get out of the class you can leave there is no any force okay because we are doing a classes for free of cost it is a charity so there is no any of the uh, you know like uh, mandatory 
or this is not a school or college for you people okay whoever they are interested only those people i want to be in the class and i want only those people to be in the group also okay this is not like a place where you can do time pass okay so i don't want anybody to give us scratches on the screen when i am teaching got it so if you are not interested you can leave the group now only immediately you can leave the group from the whatsapp group also you can leave there is no any force for you people to be here okay we are not running a college or a school where you are not going to pay us any fees uh, to maintain you all understood no this, this is a charity we are giving a free of cost social service we are doing here even though we are doing so much and you people are disturbing a lot you should have a little bit common sense okay before you disturb anybody if you are not interested leave the whatsapp group there is no any force you to be here <clears throat> have some common sense okay i am taking a shape only here again shape means arrow mark just i am putting a arrow mark itself just observe okay these are the shapes you have to increase a lot little bit okay and you have to reduce your size also little bit size also you have to reduce if you have to reduce and do some alteration here that's all then only that will come perfectly understood no just keep it in a proper way the shapes that you use here okay so here i'm going to take a diamond diamond shape okay i am not going to do copy paste and all each time i am going to insert a shape only see so each time i am going to insert a shape here i am using a arrow mark from the keyboard to make it proper okay So just make it a proper line. Drag it. Okay. So this is the one start. You can observe how I have taken this group. Like say each and every shape how I have taken. Understood no? this kind of flow charts also you have to do actually. Okay. Okay. So here uh, I want everybody, please rename yourself. Okay, Re give your full name. Say, I don't want anybody to give off of the name and all. I want everybody to give your full name as you have mentioned in the WhatsApp group. Okay, whatever names you have mentioned in the WhatsApp group, uh, make sure that you are giving your full name. So I want everybody to give a full name. Okay. And have I put Zane? Zane, Zane in the group WhatsApp meeting. 
so there is a zain in the whatsapp meeting i mean the zoom meeting now this is a first class or how many classes you have attended till now you can unmute yourself and you can speak till now how many classes you have attended zain so are you there in the whatsapp group also you can unmute yourself you can unmute yourself and you can speak you can unmute yourself and you can speak fine no issues they have taken a flow charts here and even for this flow chart on the flow chart also you can type up only just click on that and you can start typing okay so like this you have to click on that uh, shape properly that's all just do double click on that so just click on add text left side top corner you can see add text so i have taken add text make it into a center alignment like this after that you can even increase your text size okay you can also give a shape fill color whichever color you want shape fill color font color you can apply okay okay shape fill color you can apply font color you can apply okay and you can also give some uh, formatting also say formatting also you can apply okay say shape fill you can also fill you can even change the color this is of text color okay text box now huh? you will have a text color also in this okay so you can even change the text color also so just come here home tab so you can change the text color also whichever text color you want okay so like this every time you can change shape format say click on a shape fill okay say shape fill so again go to shape fill okay whichever color you want you can take that particular color okay like this understood no you can add the colors for your shape also in this method okay next is a smart art i think a smart art also i have explained you in the last class so so most of the things here it is already done now and uh, yeah let me explain you one one small option that is um, say here i have taken a small paragraph right so i am just increasing the size of that paragraph i am also giving a line spacing 1.5 i am taking a size for 12 and here i'm changing for a calibri the font i'm changing for a calibri like this say so you can even increase the font size after that select this entire thing go to your design tab design or layout yeah come to a layout option layouts come to a layout option click on this column click on two columns or three columns whichever you want you can click So if I select a columns or two columns, that will split. It will split in this way. Two columns. If I click on three columns, that will split into a three different way. Like this. Okay. So here, I am just selecting only C. Come to your insert tab. In the insert tab, you have a drop cap. Click on this drop cap and see. how it works okay so i will show you once again see observe very carefully i am going to share you once again select click on layout click on columns either two or three say whichever 
I'm selecting a two column. I can select a three column. Whichever column you want, you can select maximum. After selecting that columns, the the maximum three columns. Okay, so you can even select maximum how many columns is required for you according to that. Okay, see columns three columns. I have already done the shape formatting. No. That's why it is not coming actually. Okay, let, let me show you in the new document. The previously how I did, you have observed no, how it was taken. Okay, so just select. So you can change your uh, font style, change your font. Okay, go to insert or layout. Go to layout, take column, take two columns. Okay. So like this, understood now why it is not coming? The reason here why it is not coming is very simple. So here the reason is like uh, say, we will have our uh, column break. We will have a column break here. So that is the only reason it is not coming. That's all see, a column break is already taken. That is why it is not uh, showing also. It is not coming also. That, that is the only reason. Okay, see how I am going to change my ruler and how it is changing with. Okay, so here, so I am selecting only C. Insert tab, click on drop cap, that's all. Like this. Same like a newspaper, magazines, how you see paragraph, like that it will come. Okay, that is in the layout. Here you Wait, have a margin. Can you click, ma'am? Insert time. Drop cap. Okay. Drop cap. Clear now? Is this clear? Okay, yes, then. Sir. Yes, sir. So, next one is in the layout. Margin is nothing about normal margin that the ruler what we use that is a normal margin only orientation two types you have portrait orientation and landscape orientation maximum we already we do in the portrait only all our uh, word documents will be taken under portrait only landscape is used but not for the word document you can use this landscape for an excel document and not for the word document okay size you can see size you can choose a size a4 size always why because our printer everything will be under a4 size only so depending on a printer also we can select the page depending on a document what document we have created on that also we can change our size but normally it will be a4 only maximum that's all okay so till here it is enough for today Another one class is required for lettering, letters, letter formatting. Maximum another two classes is enough for completing a word, MS word. Maximum two classes is more than enough. Maybe by Wednesday, today is uh, Monday, right? Tuesday, Wednesday. By Wednesday, your uh, MS word document will finish. By the time, uh, I want you all to do the project. Uh, I will even give you the project tomorrow. Okay, tomorrow I will give you the project. So you can all start doing that project from tomorrow onwards. Okay. Sample, I will share you. The sample, the project, I am going to share you in the WhatsApp. That kind of uh, document you have to prepare. Uh, if anybody is perfect with that, you can start doing it from now onwards also. But anyhow, tomorrow in the class, I will show you that project, how to do that project also. Because everything from that project, I have already explained you. But tomorrow, once again, I will just show you how you can do it. Okay. Okay. Any more questions? Excuse okay, me, ma'am. Yes. 
ma'am one more time please show that uh, how to uh, page color ma'am you have attended when when did you attend the class yes ma'am i forget this one please once again ma'am no no you attended by what time you attended the class same time ma'am what 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 classes will be started same thing go to your design tab click on page color okay 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 hmm. thank you ma'am yeah okay any more questions you have guys any more questions ma'am one thing ma'am uh, after inserting the shape how to uh, write the text in it you have a right in the text shape on that only you have to just double click on that shape and it will show for you right side top corner okay can you show it once ma'am who is this can i know your name sumaiya by what time did you attend the class today uh, i was a bit late late today if you are late that is not my problem right the topic was already done previous class also shapes i have explained you how to insert previous class also. yes ma'am inserting click shapes format. i know click on shape yes. format click on add text shape format add text clear yes ma'am fine no, then that's all for today yeah please Ma'am, uh, in previous assignment which we have given, in that watermark is uh, uh, appearing above that uh, text box, ma'am. But I am not getting how to uh, get the uh, watermark above the text box, ma'am. Watermark. It is not watermark. It is a header and footer. Yes, ma'am. That is not like a water. the mark that is called as header footer okay if you go to insert tab you have a header and footer click on that option insert tab header footer so that you will be able to insert can you show it ma'am insert tab click on header and footer option just click on okay. header footer that's all here whatever you type that will be treated as a watermark only okay so no. here whatever In you whole... type be treated as a watermark only you can insert a text you can insert our pictures you can insert a logo also in that place not in the header box ma'am uh, i will show you i will share you the assignment ma'am you can share me right ma'am Share me your assignment. Yes, ma'am. Descriptive words, sir. Huh? Yes, ma'am. Descriptive words in that uh, FRL something like um, uh, English grammar. In that assignment, in this one. Yes, ma'am. I'll. That is like www. dot esl forums. dot com, ah. Huh? Yes, ma'am. That is a watermark yes, only, no. It is a watermark only, no. No, back side yes. gray color is a watermark. Below one is a shape. Yes, ma'am. Either you can use shape or you can simply highlight. You can use a shape or text box also. Yes, ma'am. For ma that. it is only text box also you can use no need of a shape also text box also you can use mm -hmm. ma'am uh, that is like www dot is a watermark that is for confirm it is a watermark only it is in a gray color whatever it is there in a gray color is a watermark for you This is a grey color, right? So I'm just changing the color here. 
This is like a watermark only. Ma'am, I'm, Ma I'm unable screen to is see. Not sharing. It is a watermark only. I have taken from the watermark only. Nothing else. Go to your watermark. Ma once you... Okay. Once you, once you put that uh, text box, ma'am, it is not uh, appearing above the text box, ma'am. What about the text box? Ma'am, uh, in the descriptive word, ma'am. Descriptive word, what it is not coming there? Above and all, it will not come. Don't try to use above and all. Make it normal only. Okay. It is a normal. Normal okay. image only I have sent you. You don't try to give it in more complicated way. Do it in a simple way. There is nothing like above, below and all. Normal text only. Descriptive, no shape also. It is a normal text box. Not even a text box. Normal text only. Even below the website as a normal text only. If you want, you can give some shade using a shape. If not, you can make you can use only black color font. That's it. Okay. Yeah. For descriptive word, there is no shape also. It's only font with the capital letters, a red color font. That's all. No shape, nothing. Or below, before your descriptive words, you have a small icon. That is an icon, not even an image. Okay. Yes, ma'am. Hmm. Anything else? No, ma'am. Okay. Whatever the flow charts I have sent you, so you can all practice with the flow charts. Next class, we will start with the letters. Okay. Okay, ma'am. So, Rabia can take a screenshot of today's attendance. Screenshot done. Okay, then we can close the meeting now. Thank you.